what's up guys welcome once again to another video so i was on instagram and then i saw this combination here and people were saying that it really grows the hair fast like it makes the hair really grow fast so among all these products here i've already tried them myself before and my hair has really grown yeah apart from this one here i've never used this one but of course jamaica i can swear by the uh, uh, virgin hair fertilizer sulfur 8 and the jamaican black castor oil it has these oils one time that when i was using them they really made my hair grow fast and thick so i saw people mixing this and i tried to look for uh, a video about this online and i didn't find it so i decided to make one maybe this is how <laughs> how people make the video so what you're going to need i'm just taking a, a small bowl or something and then i'm going to take from each uh product just a teaspoon because this is something i make i made uh for one application so each application you take one teaspoon from each and everything here so before i rumble too much let's just get started okay so what you're going to need as i said a teaspoon of everything so this is the do grow hair fertilizer I'm just going to take a teaspoon. Well, this will look more than this teaspoon. I'm always heavy handed. And yeah, just put one. One teaspoon. I take the sulfur aid. Sulfur aid. I used this when I was a kid. It helped me from uh, reducing dandruffs as well. And when I was uh, relaxed, it healed my scabs uh, whenever whenever I got I got a wound and of course virgin hair fertilizer virgin hair fertilizer oh look some of it is coming out on this side it's okay some fell here take some of that just a little bit and put it inside and Jamaican black casserole I'll put two or one and a half one and a half oh look at me that's it so next what you're going to do is just mix so now that we have everything, we have the do grow, the sulfur, and the hair, virgin hair fertilizer, and Jamaican black castor. So what I'm going to do now is just mix. okay so what i'm going to do is just apply on my scalp so there are oils that are good just applying on the hair and there are oils that are good applying on the scalp because this one is for hair growth uh like the shave powder is for length retention but the fenugreek oil i can apply on the on my scalp because it really promotes hair growth and it makes your hair also healthy so and I'm I just going to show you what okay 
I'm going to just show you, I mean, like you just apply it on the scalp. There's nothing much to it, you know? And then I just rub. And I have heard that this one makes you a hairline, like, okay, I don't have, um, my hairline is not really damaged. But there was one time it was damaged and uh, I used virgin fertilizer and black, black Jamaican black castor oil to grow my hair back. Okay. Well, you get the idea. I mean, I, you just apply in your scalp. That's it. Nothing much. And... Um, just to to tell you i've used this like one time when you use it you'll feel like your scalp is getting warm and i guess this is like the blood flow is also being uh flown quickly and this introduces like quick hair growth and yeah so i was just showing you the mixture and then uh i will make an update and say if it really made my hair grow faster like in two weeks because i've used the virgin fertilizer and the jamaican black castor oil i saw results in just two weeks yeah and i will try to use this consistently so yeah i just hope that somebody gives it a try and if somebody has given it a try please leave a comment down and um, i mean help, we help each other and see uh, because everyone has been comment was commenting yo this was the bomb this combination is the bomb whoever came up with this combination is making my my kids hair dry <laughs> my hair, hair dry hair grow fast and I say, why shouldn't I give it a try? Because I have no, I know this, um, most of the products that really made my hair grow. Yeah. And you know, somebody like me, sometimes I use a product, it really boosts the hair growth and then it becomes like uh, normal. It doesn't make a big difference. So I always look for some things, yeah, that will, I mean push my hair back to growing faster until get used to it then I look for something else so I see this it makes my hair warm and then I also must after doing that I massage my hair put my head upside down it helps it really helps I feel my head is warm like for two days which is good which is good so that's it that's all I was going to review about. And this is enough for me to apply on my whole head. And because this is solid oil, I will wash this out after two days, but I will reapply it again <laughs> just because it really helps. Uh, I mean, I just like um, most of the products and the sulfur it really 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 reduces with dandruffs if somebody has dandruffs or has a problem with the scalp but if i have dandruffs um or if you have dandruffs you can always wash your hair with uh, apple cider vinegar this also helps so that's it that's it i hope uh this video was uh, helpful i hope it will help somebody this will it says that uh, makes your hair grow very fast mega fast that's what they say and if somebody has problems like with hairlines it will grow back your hairline but i would advise you like not to be braiding your hair hairline often like uh the last time i did my braids was like two weeks ago and I am not in a hurry to go and rebraid them because uh, this part here, yeah, you see where my, my braids are now? They were here. Yeah, so if you keep doing, uh, pulling these hairlines like that, that's how you damage your hair, hairline. Just leave it, just leave, just leave your hair. Let your hair grow, give it some time. Don't be going to the salon or to be braiding your hair after every two weeks and then don't ex you don't expect. Uh, your hairline to be damaged and you think like there's something which would grow your hair you will you will not be helping yourself if you keep repeating the same mistakes 
So leave your hairline, just leave it, leave it. The best way to grow hair actually is to just, to grow thick hair is also to just leave it in a protective style for um, quite a while. That's it. Okay, so I'm signing out and I want to appreciate all those people who have subs subscribed. I hope you're going to share this video. And uh, if you have not subscribed, please subscribe, please subscribe. And I just want to say thank you really. 3,000 for me, Kathleen? Ah, oh, I'm touched. I'm really touched. I'm really grateful. And yeah, I will do an update in like two weeks. Yeah, because um, the weather is getting cold. And yeah, I have to go back to weave. Even though I like my braids. So thank you for watching and please don't forget to like, share and subscribe and yeah, call your friends, pay your friends, tell your grandparents, your neighbors, whoever, tell them to join in the club because yeah, thank you so much. Bye. <laughs>